I am the Reverend Josh Hostler. Um, my role is Associate Priest for Adult Formation, which is a mouthful of a title, um, at St. Paul's. I joined the Bridge Builders at some point shortly after it began. My name is Nadim Israr, and I'm the President of Islamic Society of Whatcom County. In January, when the President Trump took over in the community, there were a lot of tension, so we thought, you know, look, that it will be a better way that if we understand each other, you know, learn about each other, so all the misconceptions can be eliminated and we understand. If we have any differences, we can, you know, work those out and we should work on the com commonalities which we have between uh, the people of the book. Um, before the election, um, we at St. Paul's had planned to, to hold a uh, three-part weekend series at St. Paul's called Islam 101. Um, part of the problem was that um, we didn't really know very many Muslims in the community. And so we, we started to reach out, and then some folks from Bridge Builders and from the Islamic Society came and attended our series at St. Paul's and were able to answer uh, questions and to speak in an impromptu way uh, at a much deeper level than we had anticipated would be possible because of these friendships that had just then formed. It was really beautiful. And when we live together, and when we don't know if each other, then you know, then it's very shameful to us. Well, so, for example, you know, part of my belief is that if I go to sleep stomach full, and my neighbor goes to sleep empty stomach, day of judgment, God will hold me responsible for that. So I need to know my neighbor. But if I am not talking to my neighbor, I will never know. So, we talk about the three Abrahamic faiths, and I think that it would, well. I'll set alongside that, that, that Christianity is the, is the dominant religion in the United States, certainly the most numerous, um, but sometimes it's shocking how little Christians know about their own faith. Um, it's shocking how few would remember that Jesus was a Jew, or who would know that, that Jesus appears in the Quran. Um, it is so important for us to find those points of commonality, because our faith is not about who is the most correct. Uh, I don't care how correct you are, it doesn't make you more loving automatically. And yet love is at the heart of all three of these faiths. Every week someone talks about their religion, someone talks about their religion, so what they do is they just explain everything in detail. And we sit down and listen and then, you know, things which we don't understand, we ask questions. And, you know, because we, uh, the person who's talking understand that we don't know anything about their there for them so far. So there is no question which will be an offensive question. I, I'll admit I have questions that I'm still sitting on, that I'm holding back on, because I think you have to, you have to tend that ground of friendship first sometimes. Some of the questions are harder and the, the trust comes uh, through um, believing that this friendship is worth taking the time. Uh, if there are harder questions, they will come. Short term is that, you know, bring as many people to our group as possible. So then, you know, so we could bring the whole community of people, of group of people who live in Whatcom County. And then, you know, to learn about each other. And then if something happens to one group, then we can all stand together as a family without any kind of a fear. You know, just like family, you don't need a reason to stand up with because it's a family, you stand up with them. So this is the short and long-term goal, as I understand. I would say the same as Nadim. Um, very similarly, I, I feel that it's our, it's our differences that make us interesting to one another. Um, and I, I don't need to believe the same things as you do um, to have a relationship with you, to have a friendship. Um, and I hope that Bridge Builders will continue to do that and will continue to grow. Of course, uh, we may need a larger meeting space. <laughs> but we'll figure that out when the time comes.